In this short tutorial, I'm going to run through how you can integrate e to the power of 4x. So we have our integral there, and we have the problem that it's got a 4 in front of the x. It would be a lot easier if it were just e to the x, because the integral of e to the x is simply e to the x. The difficulty here is dealing with that number 4. And the trick that you can use is you can come up with a substitution. We can just say that u equals 4x. So actually, our 4 is going to be gone, and we're going to have e to the u. And the integral of e to the u is simply e to the u. But we have another problem in that we have dx. You can't do the integral of e to the u dx. We have to change that dx to something with a du in it. So what we do is we find the derivative of u. So we get du dx equals 4. We need, now need to rearrange that for dx equals. We do the rearrangement and we get an expression for dx. So we now have everything we need to do a proper substitution. So this 4x here can be replaced with u, and dx can be replaced with our expression for dx. And on this line, that is all I've done. So we've now got an integral that is only in u. We've also got this 4 on the bottom, and that can actually be taken out of the integration, so we can take out a factor of a quarter. And that gives us a nice, simple integration. The integral of e to the u is simply e to the u plus your constant. So we end up with the answer of that. And that is actually our final answer. So a trick to remember is when you're doing e to the power of a constant times x, the constant simply moves to the bottom here and the um, e to the power doesn't change. And that gives you the integration straight away. Hopefully this, this video was helpful to you. And finally, thank you very much for watching.